What up, YouTube? Humble Waivers. It's JF coming at you with another one from uh, Hairstyle that turned into my lifestyle. Um, last night while brushing, I discovered, um, I guess, a different way of brushing and I guess a uh, uh, science behind it. Um, I'm working on my crown right now. So I noticed that when I brush with a hard brush, your hair, or I mean my hair, you know, everybody's hair tends to move because of the fact that, you know, now you're shifting it from, you know, one place, you know, to another because of the stiffness in the bristles versus if you had a soft brush, you're not moving nothing really. You just, you know, you're just uh, polishing, I guess you could say. So, um, with my crown hard, um, what I started doing was just, um, brushing, I guess you could say, uh, sideways to just spread or even out my entire head. So, I'm going to demonstrate. Basically, spreading it. See how my hair is moving, opening up, allowing for, for one your hair to breathe in that and also the hair that's growing will now have a place to lay with the rest of your hair and also I found out the placement of the brush determines your pattern your connection Give an example. If I hold the brush like this and I brush down. Yes, I brush down, but at the same time, did that connect to my head? And then at the same time, did it leave a line because of the fact that I didn't brush consistently? So the placement of the brush, the movement of your head, determines your pattern and just the whole design of your head. I also notice, say you're brushing like this and you moved. Well, just because you was brushing and you moved, now your hair could have went on a slant just because of the fact that you moved while you was brushing. So if you don't want crazy pattern that <clears throat> definitely looks original but at the same time you really don't like it because it's not uniform take your time when you're moving your head at the same time you're brushing because that definitely determines a lot but like I said spread them out S spread them out so that the the hair that you will have grow inside your scalp have a place to evenly join the wave party. And since you have a hard brush, you can basically brush brush crazy, especially that crown. Just brush crazy it'll come in you know your crown I know mine is like the hardest thing to have grow in at the same time you know uh, get designed with the rest of my head it takes my crown probably three months just to get a little bit of growth to where now I can start seeing most of the formation so brush all in it it doesn't even matter Now, for the polishing, you want to do the same thing. So, you want to do the same thing.
Hope this has been helpful. Peace. Salute. Make waves, not war.